it going everybody, Stu and Jody here, and today's with the NNDM Nano Dimensions. Pretty good day for this one, up 29 cents to shy of 4% on the day. I would have liked to hold the 770s, but uh, you know, you, you get what you get here. It looks like we have some resistance at that uh, 1760, well, technically support, but we'll, we'll probably break it after here, because since VWEP is right here at 756, that would be our support level as well. Like I said, that resistance is going to be at that uh, 770, all the way up to 773. And then the breakout point is really going to be that 797 level, as well as um, the 811. It, it was a pretty big dip that it had here yesterday. And I thought it was going good with the high up there at the 831 on the 5 day, 5 to 15 minute chart. We'll have to see. Obviously, everybody's mind is that 1789 level that it uh, basically triple topped with the earnings coming out that was 3-11 negative 20 cents that does play a factor in why it is dipping uh, as you guys see here with all these lines we covered nndm a whole bunch so definitely uh click the link in the description during the patreon to get alerts about nndm and every stock also if you choose the five dollar tier you get to make uh, or to have me make any video uh, stock related. And uh, NNDM could be that choice if you uh, join it. All right, guys, so we're here. The, also, the $11. If you take a look at all these red lines, 950, 1050, 12, 14, 1490, 1557, and 1789 up there, that's going to be your major resistance points. Now, we say this because this is multiple days. Of hitting this level either supports or resistance and as you guys know old support becomes new resistance and vice versa the volume today was good though um, just shy of 16 million shares you would like to see more but you know granted for a seven dollar stock uh, it is okay in my opinion taking a look at the news now it says Kathy Wood, the only article today, Kathy Wood buys yet another workhorse dip, also as DraftKing, Peloton, and Square. I am trying to look of where NNDM is featured in here. Well, I, it's got to be featured if it was in here, eh? She must have talked about it briefly for a sentence, but really nothing i think it was just a nice bounce off of it we'll have to see if this bounce can hold rare right narrow dimensions um okay so they bought 463,000. i'm reading i'm reading right here guys 463,128 shares of the 3d printing company representing 0.09 percent of the etf okay that is um that is very good so maybe it is pushing up because of that um yeah so we'll have to see so there has been some pretty good news going into april here they, they got a new uh, a new president um new ceo and it looks like that just business as usual uh really uh for next quarter's earnings i would like them to be better than they get 20 cents Last quarter, way over here, if you can see it, because it's kind of blending in. It was negative 45 cents, and um, I believe it was negative 45. Was it positive? No, yeah, see, negative 45 cents. I would like it to be, like I said, above negative 20, and positive side, of course. And anything positive could get a bounce. We do have a major support level at the 659. That's going to be a level that it cannot break. Because if it is, it's going to put it right back where it was back in October, November, and December. And we really want it to stay above, like I said, that's 660. And push up past 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And make new high of $18. I think we can get there, though, uh, with Kathy Wood. You know, she's a big name in the investing community, the, the SPAC community, you know, ETF community. And... Um, they're buying almost half a million shares. That's gonna, it did obviously have a big impact and maybe now you'll get some more retail traders or maybe some more institutional traders hopping on the board 
And if NADM can have a good um, catalyst, you know, they got they partnered up with a company, they're looking to buy out a company, you know, their sales are going good. Anything positive, uh, I feel like they have to be releasing to get that price up. But if they're not, and you guys know NADM had a whole bunch of offerings. And uh, that was obviously also what has been driving up the price because it was basically a nice sale going on and everybody just loaded up on them. So uh, let me know if you traded it. NNDM, Narrow Dimensions here. Let me know if you plan on trading it or uh, what's the deal with your portfolio on this one. I don't own any shares, but obviously I'm always looking to add add some uh, to my portfolio here. Um, like I said, guys, NNDM, thanks for watching. Give it a like. So if you haven't, questions, comments, and PMs, drop down below and I'll uh, try to answer them all. All right, guys, click the link, join the Patreon. All right, see you in the next one.